Electrons have an unusual property called spin one-half, which emerges from Paul Dirac's relativistic wave equation. Dirac believed that this property could not be physically visualized, but since this is a material world, we're going to show you a simple model of the electron shell that displays this mysterious spin one-half property. Ordinarily, when we rotate simple objects with fixed surfaces, they behave in a simple and obvious way. When you rotate through a full turn, you look exactly the same as when you started. But the electron is unusual. When you rotate it through a full turn, it does not look the same as when we started. You have to rotate it through a second full turn to get it back to the original state. And that is spin one half. Electrons can take two spin states, spin up and spin down. We think of these as when the shell rotates, the surface involutes up or down as shown in these two variations here. Both models are still spin one half and require rotating twice to get back to where they started. When viewed with the right hand rule rotation vectors shown, we can see why they're called spin up and spin down since the shell involutes upward or downward. Here are the models with their poly spinner notations. Finally, a positron can be seen as a time reversed electron, which just means that it rotates in the opposite direction. And here we have all four spinner components moving at the same time. And here is the Dirac by spinner notation for each of the four states. Taken together, these four models give a simple physical view of the basis spinners for the Dirac equations.